This is Strata Launch, the world's largest airplane by Wingspan, which has successfully completed its first flight. Strata Launch is designed to act as a flying launch pad for satellites. It aims to make access to orbit more affordable and accessible by launching satellites into space from the aircraft, rather than from the ground using rockets. The idea is to fly the plane up to 32,000 feet high. Once at cruising altitude, the rocket's engines would ignite, carrying it and its satellite cargo the rest of the way into space, and then releasing the satellite into orbit. The benefit of this system is only a select few facilities like the Kennedy Space Center in Florida can handle rocket launches, which means tight competition for scheduling and long wait times. But airplanes can take off from almost any runway, which gives greater flexibility and eventually will allow for quick turnaround between launches, which Strata Launch hopes will give its aircraft a competitive edge for those wishing to launch satellites into orbit. Strata Launch is the largest airplane in the world to fly by wingspan. It's a catamaran style aircraft with twin fuselages, a wingspan measuring 117 meters, which is wider than the length of a football field. It also has six Boeing 747 engines, a 28 wheel landing gear system, and it has a maximum takeoff weight of 1.3 million pounds, and has been eight years in the making. In April 2019, the aircraft took off from Mojave Air and Spaceport, about 93 miles from Los Angeles. It flew at altitudes of up to 3 miles and performed numerous maneuvers, including a simulated landing approach. But after just one flight, the plane is now up for sale at 400 million US dollars. Stratolaunch has been steadily downsizing this year, with much of its workforce already laid off, despite it had plans to use the plane to launch a small rocket in 2020. As for the 400 million asking price, the buyer will not just get the plane, but they will also be getting the intellectual property and the facilities. But it does not seem like they can find a buyer. Not even Northrop Grumman seems likely to pay 400 million, particularly because it's not clear how much of a market there would be for the launch services of Strata Launch. Even the billionaire Richard Branson, who owns Virgin Galactic, said he would buy Strata Launch for one dollar. Therefore, there's a chance that the world's biggest plane will end up in a museum like the Spruce Goose, which was the world's biggest plane when Howard Hughes had it built in the 1940s. But with the ever-increasing delays and the costs associated with launching a rocket into space, it will only be a matter of time till someone comes up with a viable alternative. All it will take is those two little things none of us have enough of. Time and money. Anyway, that's the end of this video. Thanks for watching, and we'll see you next time. Bye bye.